Hey my YouTube family, I'm back with another video. So we're going to do these Bob plaits today. So for everybody who's watching, thanks for watching. And let's get into these Bob plaits. Don't forget if you have any comments or concerns, please comment in the description below. Y'all know I don't like to talk your head off. I know y'all like to hear my voice though. <laughs> but anyways, let's dive right into this video. Stay tuned. Please, please, please don't forget for any product that you are using for your client's hair. Don't forget to put it between your parts because we need these parts clean and crispy. Okay.
Okay, so tip number one, you would do bob plaits just like regular plaits. Only thing the difference is it's shorter and also um, we're going to tie it when we get at a certain length. So you're gonna plait the hair till you get to the length you want. Then you're gonna take a small piece of hair and you're gonna wrap it around the hair. Then you're gonna tie it into a knot. And then what I normally do is I wrap it one more time just to secure the knot. But it's up to you, but I prefer you to wrap it. But you could try wrap once or twice to see which one you prefer. I'm going to just continue the same process until I'm done with this row. Then I will show y'all how do I burn the ends to actually bend it to actually create the bald look.
Okay, so tip number two. You're gonna burn exactly where you did the, the knot set, and then you're gonna take your scissors and then you're gonna cut the extra excess hair off. But make sure you get a nice burn so you can create that little, you know, burn piece at the end so we can have that little bob, flip, 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 door bobs. You no, know, make it do what it do. And tip number three, if you feel like when you burning it and you feel it and you feel like it's like still soft, you can still take the lighter and burn it some more because that means that it's not hard and it's not going to um actually keep that that ball that you actually look for at the end, like that burn hardness. So make sure you burn it again so it can be hard so it won't unwrap or come out. And y'all, I had to ask my clients, like, was it burning her? Because, baby, they were burning my hands, so she actually started feeling it. I'm like, girl, you better put that shirt up on it. Because, <laughs> baby, this thing is a little hot. You hear me? If you have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know again in the description below. But that's pretty much it I wanted to explain to y'all because everything else is going to be repeating the same process. So y'all just stay tuned, continue watching this video. And don't forget to subscribe. You should already subscribe by now. But yeah, all right.
Thank you.